one restaurant owner in Minnesota, fed up with crime. She's been assaulted and burglarized six times since she opened her doors. That was 18 months ago. Annie Rose is the owner and operator of Lost Fox, and Annie Rose joins me now. Please, just as we start, take me through the burglaries and the assault. We all want to know exactly what happened. I, there were there were multiple burglaries um, and attempted break-ins all overnight, usually around 4, 4.30 in the morning. A lot of it is the uh, train. We're the last stop on the train, and I believe people have an easy way to get off and on, which is a good way to get in and out. Um, as for the assault, that was at 9.30 in the morning in front of children, in front of customers. There was a, a guy that has been in before and has robbed us, has taken the the barista's tips came in and I tried to stop him from coming in and he pushed the door in my face and hit me and uh five hours later when I was able to go to the uh the urgent care I got stitches from that one so what, what do you what do you um, think about this bill in California which would fine small uh, store owners if they tried to stop a robbery what do you make of that I think that's ridiculous. Yes. I think that, well, I'm not 100% sure which, which bill you're talking about. I haven't um, read up on it. But we are all doing everything we can to create business and create commerce and community in areas and just make a livelihood for ourselves and our children and our family. And we have people who have no repercussions for what they're doing out there, and the fact that right. then we would be responsible for it sounds absurd. Are you going to leave? Are you going to leave? No. Oh no, we're not leaving. This is what we're doing. This is, this is our, this is our life right now. This we're building this for our children. We're building this for the people who uh, surround us. We are there. This is our home. It's basically right. our home. We spend more time there than we do at home. So. Uh -huh. No, uh, we're not going anywhere. Annie, I just want to thank you very much for coming on the show and telling everybody what it's like, what is reality like for someone like you. Did a great job, and thank you very much indeed for being with us. Hope you can come again. Good luck, ma'am. Good luck. Thanks. Sure thing.